Hello, I'm Greta Van Susteren, and here is your Full Court Fast Break. A major milestone in the race for COVID-19 vaccine. This week, the U.S. seen its first phase three clinical trials. Moderna and the NIH collaborating on one vaccine candidate. By November or December, they hope to know if it will be effective. Also, Pfizer and BioNTech's investigative vaccine is in its final stage of testing. Those companies say they are on track to apply for regulatory review by October. Both inoculations would be given in two doses over several weeks. The question is, how often will we need to be vaccinated? Will it be one and done? Or will we need to come back every year like we do for the flu shot? I asked infectious disease specialist, Dr. Jeannie Morazzo, for some insight. We know that antibodies to the coronaviruses that we are familiar with from the common cold don't last. Maybe they last several months, maybe they last a year, maybe they last three years. So if I was just hypothesizing an answer to your question based on what we know about coronavirus immunity, I would say, I hope this vaccines, if they work, the vaccines, I hope they induce immunity for at least a year. It would be fantastic if it was a couple of years. Are we gonna get away with a single lifetime shot? I am very skeptical. The other side of that coin that we have in our favor, which is at least trying to inject some positivity into this dire discussion, is that at least the coronavirus that we're dealing with does not seem to mutate in a crazy way, like influenza. So there are some different variants. We know there's a Chinese variant, there's a European variant, but right now we are at least somewhat confident that we're not going to have to develop different vaccines for different quote unquote strains like we do for influenza. So that's a positive thing. We are months out from knowing if Moderna and Pfizer's vaccines will work. But if they do, Moderna will reportedly charge up to $60 per the two dose course. Pfizer will reportedly charge $39. Want more Full Court Press? Tune in Sundays. We bring politics home, covering the national stories that impact you.